um, there's like three aspects to that um, which are important to me. Uh, how did we survive the last hundred years? And I think flexibility is the name of the game. I mean, we had many, many changes. We had to focus, we had to diversify. Uh, there were different periods uh, where we followed different strategies. And I think um, things can be true for 10 years and then it might change. And for the next 10 years, it's, not, it's gonna be different. So as I said, flexibility is important. Also, short notice, like 2009, 2010, we lost like 25% of our turnover, and uh, we still made a solid profit. And I think um, being able to survive crises is a really important thing. It's not just getting everything right, you know? And I think we've done that. And why could we do that? because we stick together, it, it's quite simple. We have a great company culture, and every time I say that, I feel like I'm uh, sort of, yeah, people who are not, haven't experienced it will maybe not understand, but it's really like a family. It's people like to work at class, they are so engaged and so motivated, and we just uh, had the 100-year uh, anniversary for our employees. And we had a World Family Day for everybody at the same day with their families at the different uh, locations. And uh, um, just to feel how the creativity with which they, they we had a world um, streaming uh, via internet mm -hmm. and the people could, uh, uh, the different locations could um, introduce themselves to their colleagues, especially the ones that don't have um, an international aspect to their work. And it was just enormous to feel that we're really a family. And I want to keep that. And I think that's gonna bring us through the next 100 years. Because I think the global trend of larger farms is visible anywhere from India to the States, doesn't matter. It just depends on the scale. And uh, depending on the scale, of course, the technology or Machinery is, is, is also uh, different. Um, definitely more efficient. I mean, we all know that there is not more, we can't increase the amount of land we have uh, to produce food for the global population. And uh, it's not very romantic, but more, even more of a business, more of an industry in that sense, with uh, more and more better educated people. And of course, uh, more intelligent machinery.